know you've been wanting to go in the Ross and see what they have, but you've been feeling a little iffy about if it's going to be clean, organized, or if you're going to find anything good in general. Well, this video may change your mind a little bit. So if you're interested in what I'm going to show you in this video, stay tuned. you beauty squad i miss you guys welcome back to my youtube channel uh uh with the big head bounce <laughs> um if you are new here shout out to you for being here and if you are into everything fashion style beauty and lifestyle then baby girl this channel is for you so be sure to subscribe hit that notification bell so you will be alerted the next time your girl drop a video Today, you beauties, we have a Ross try-on haul. Now, I grabbed $300 worth of Ross goodies to see what they had in for the summertime. So, we ain't gonna do a whole bunch of talking. Per usual, we're gonna jump right into this video and try on these clothes. All right, as y'all can see, the bag. Y'all see them? All right, we're gonna start off with the accessories first. First up is this little number. It is a Aldo bag. Let me get a little closer so y'all can get in on the details. Y'all see that? It's an Aldo bag. It's like this white cream color. And then super, super cute on the inside. Freaking love it. And then has the Aldo symbol right there. Um, these bags I live for, you guys, because... They're super cute. They're not extra, extra big. I love the envelope look. And then I just love how dainty and cute it is. And then I don't really have a lot of white bags, so I picked this one up. I thought it was super cute. So, yeah, here's the first bag. This bag cost $29.99 from Ross. And that's crazy because, again, this is an Aldo bag, you guys, an Aldo bag. Alright, here is the next bag. Get into the details. Love it. Now, this is screaming summer, you guys. Like, if this don't say nothing else, it says summer, a little bit of spring, we ready. That's what it says. So, I love this one as well. Again, it is the same shape, top handle. Now, all of these bags do come with a crossbody bag in the inside so if you want to wear them as a crossbody you have that option as well but i'm more of a top handle type of gal you know what i mean i like to you know <laughs> you know what it is so this is what i like to do as far as my bags oh i'm sorry here is the top handle bag right here i mean i'm sorry the crossbody bag right here and again this bag was 29.99 um, from ross i think it was a super great buy Next one is this quilted Kelly Green bag. Kelly Green has had your girl in a chokehold for, for months now, baby. It's been months. I've been in love with Kelly Green because this is this green uh, can be paired with so many different colors. So I had to grab the Kelly Green with the chain straps. Freaking love the bag. All, again, this is an Aldo bag. And then that is the inside. I freaking love it. I love the hardware. I love everything about this bag and the way it buckles and everything. And it's cute and dainty. And again, if you wanted to, you can wear it as a crossbody. But again, I'm more of a strap, you know, kind of gal. So love, love, love it. And then it has the um, Aldo sign right here on the back. But the gold hardware on this freaking Kelly Green is amazing, you guys. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Alright, I also grabbed this duffel. Now, I know y'all thinking, baby girl, that's giving fake uh, blue, uh, what's it called, Burberry vibes. But, I thought it was super, super cute. Can you imagine getting dressed in something super cute with similar colors, some black and white, whatever, and then throwing this on as a bag? Like, you gonna kill the girls because it's gonna be so unexpected, you know what I mean? You know, you're not expecting nobody to walk around a big-ass duffel bag as a purse. But, baby, for me, it was a vibe. It is not about the freaking uh, reference to Burberry. For me, it is more about the aesthetic of the bag, the colors, 
And then, like I said, if I pop this on right now with a cute outfit, it's giving life. Love it, love it, love it. This is also, this also can do as a overnight bag, a spinning in the night bag. <laughs> All right, so you have the inside here of the bag. And then you also have a crossbody strap. It has a bunch of compartments in the inside. This bag was $34.99. Worth every penny, I would buy it again. <laughs> But not least, I bought a pair of metallic pumps. Y'all know I'm a pump girl. Y'all know I'm a pump girl. Don't even act surprised like you don't know. You know I am a pump girl. So my feet has grown. So my last metallic pumps are, I believe, a seven or a seven and a half. Well, when your body, you know, get bigger, your feet get bigger, baby. It just, it's just, it's just nature, okay? So it happens. So I had to end up buying me another pair of metallic pumps. These are Charles by Charles David. Love this brand. I have three or four pair of boots by this guy. Very comfortable, very durable. Love, love, love. These were $17.99. Brand spanking new. Love, love, love. It's giving, it's giving, it's giving. Alright you guys, so that was it for the accessories. We're going to jump right into these clothes and see what goodies I got in this bag. We're going to start off with some dresses I picked up. I thought this number was super, super, super cute. It's giving sunset. Let's try this baby on, baby. Let's try this baby on. Now, this is the first time I'm trying on these clothes, you guys. So, I don't know if they're going to fit or how they're going to fit. This is me, raw and uncut, trying on these clothes fresh out the bag. All right, let's try this baby on and see what she is giving. Because, you know, you see how wrinkled it is. You see it's fresh out the bag. It is fresh out the bag. Um, you're going to untie that because it was a little tight on my arms, you know. I ain't unbig my back yet for the summer, so it's a little tight. It's a little tight. It's a little tight. All right, she's cute. Okay. I probably would do this number. Let me go ahead and move my strap down so y'all can't see that. I probably would do this number and, you know, one draping off the shoulder. And then in the back, you can tie it. Let's see. Tie it like this to give you a little waist detail. You know what I mean? Give you a little. But she's cute. And she got pockets. Love, love, love. You know me, I'm probably going to go ahead and just put on a belt. That's just my thing. But she's giving everything. I love her. I am not too crazy about the slits in the arms, if I'm going to be honest. You tie it here, and then I'm not too crazy about that. I probably would have preferred a puff sleeve, if I'm just going to be honest. But I will say she's a cute little summer number. You know, the girls love anything with pockets. Love, love, love. Here is the back. Okay, I can get with this. I can get with this. Like I said, she just need a little steaming. I need to stench the waist, you know, to give her some, some body. To show off some body. With a cute little sun hat. And then my little one of my little bags. This will be cute. I can, I can get with this. What y'all think? Keep a return. What are we doing? What are we doing? Drop it in the comments and let me know. All right, you guys. So for this next dress, I thought was super, super cute. I had to go ahead and take off my tank top for this one. But I love how the girls is just sitting and I don't need no dang on bra, baby. You know I love anything where I don't need no bra, okay? If I don't need no bra, it is T approved. Because, baby, half the time I want to wear one anyway. Okay, she is cute. She is giving. I like her. Um, she is a little tight on the straps, but I'm pretty sure, yeah, I can adjust them. I just didn't adjust them. All right, so this is the back and how she looks. She's not too short. She is cute. Um, this color is like a, like a, it's not like a mint, but it's like a, I don't know. It's like one of those darker but lighter greens. I don't like. It's kind of like an army green, but it's a little, little lighter than that. It's hard to explain. But the ruffles are giving. She is cute. I love her with some nice platforms. I probably would throw on a sun hat with her too. But I love the length of this dress. It is not giving too much. I feel like if I bend over, I should be good. 
Love, love, love. What y'all think? Keep or return? What do y'all think in the comments? I love this. I'll probably put on my Spanx so it'll look, give me a little suction, you know what I mean? But I do think she's cute and flirty and I love her. So what do y'all think? Drop it in the comments. Let me know. Keep it return. You guys, so here is the last and final dress. Now, you know we all love a good slip dress. You can't go wrong with a good slip dress. They are perfect for the summer. Very, very thin and cute to wear. This one... I might need to go up a size because I don't like how the neck is falling. Like, what's going on with this neck? I can't, I can't. Um, I know it's supposed to kind of drape like that. But I also feel like the boobies are kind of smushed down. I don't know. What y'all think? She's cute. This, first of all, this pink on this melanated skin. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Uh, it is cute. She does have a split here on the side. And then here is how the back look. I don't know how I'm feeling about this one. I think I would prefer to go up a size. I don't like the fact that I'm going to have to wear a bra with this one. Because you can see all the nips and the slips and everything else. But the color is everything. It's like a fuchsia, hot pink vibe. I do love her. She would be very, very cute with like an oversized blazer. If it was like for a cold night, date night out, um, or just a daytime look. You could pair this with some tennis shoes for sure. Let me try it on with these pumps. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, she's cute. She's cute, okay. Change out my accessories. Maybe I just need to put on a little Spanx. And, you know, she's cute. I can I can dig her. She's cute. I mean, the it's not like it's sucking me in. I just feel like I'm going to have to wear a strapless bra. And then this part right here is giving me the blues. I'll figure it out. I don't know. What you guys think? What you guys thinking? With the... With the I mean, not necessarily with these shoes, but I did want to see how it looked with some heels on. I don't know. What y'all think? You know, the boobies a little, they go a little crazy right now. What y'all think? What y'all think? Y'all let me know. Is she worth keep or return? I feel like she's very sexy, though. Like, I'm feeling real sexy in this right now. It's, it's put your night down, no. <laughs> it's feeling Johnny Gillish, baby. I mean, this ain't no red dress. But, um, it's close to it, baby. That's what it's giving. It's giving. Giving you the best that I got. <laughs> it's not Anita. It is sexy, though. All right, y'all tell me what y'all think. Let me know. Keep a return. All right, you guys. So, I am back in my, the attire that I started off with. I wore this so it would be easier to try on these clothes. So, for the purpose of this next, um, portion of the video, I'm going to keep this top on. I'm going to do some skirts. And some bottoms. And let's see what I got. Let's see what I got. Let's see what I got. So here's the first skirt. It's giving... Baby, it's giving salsa, baby. She cute. Alright, let's try her on. Let's try her on. Alright. Oh, shit. Hold on. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Can I get it? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no. Mm-mm. It's giving, baby, I, I can't breathe, okay? She's cute and all, but she's small, baby. She got to go on back to the stove. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Get this shit off me. All right, here we go. Woo, Lord. That just took my whole day away, okay? All right, so this is the skirt. She's super cute, but, um, baby, she ain't fitting. What size is this? This is a large. So maybe I should grab some extra larges because this ain't giving, baby. This ain't giving. All right. I have this same skirt in pink. I have the same skirt in pink. And then I have another yellow color, but with the print on there because the skirt is giving. However, it's not giving for a tea, baby. I can't fit it, okay? I need larges. I mean, I need extra larges. Yeah, these are larges. The price is $12.99 for each of these. 
I thought these were super cute, given Fiesta, given Salsa. These are the skirts, but I, it, it ain't for me, baby. These these hips is hipping. This this flat ass is flat assing. It ain't working, baby. So we're going to go ahead and return these. They're super cute, and I do think that they're good quality, uh, especially for the price for only be $13. I thought that this was super cute. But we're going to go ahead and get these back to Ross, baby. They ain't for me. We're going to get these back to Ross, okay? I got these hot pink pants. Y'all know I love everything about a wide, uh, wide leg pair of pants. I have these in the extra large. These are $13.99. Let's see. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, we got action, baby. We got action. All right, can I button it, though? Yes, I can. Come on now, pink pants. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me make sure I can button it. All right. All right, so these are the pants. Oh, yeah, they're giving. For sure. Come on, babe. Oh, man, you cannot go wrong with a pink pair of pants. Oh my god, yes. I mean, of course I won't wear these shorts with them because you see all type of lines in the booty area. But they are cute for $14. Come, come on. Let me give y'all a little visual. Let me give you a little something to think about when you're picking up these pants. Let me go ahead and give you a little visual. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to give you a little visual real quick. A little color block moment. You know what I mean? We're going to give you a little color block moment so we can, so you can go on the Ross and pick up these pants, baby. Now, all of this stuff, you guys, I purchased within the week. So, you should be able to find it in your local Ross. I'm going to go ahead and button this thing. You can't tell me this ain't, this ain't a vibe. <laughs> vibe check. No shirt. Now, we're going to go ahead and no shirt. It's a vibe. It's a vibe check. Come on, pink pants. Uh, 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 <laughs> it's a vibe. I had to give y'all a little, a little, you know, just a little visual so y'all can see how dope these pants are with this orange blazer. It's orange, you know what I mean? It's giving, it's giving, it's giving. But this, just so you know, is always a moment. Pinking, um, orange, always a moment. Always gonna win. It's gonna eat every time. All right, so I had to give y'all that visual. Do I think these are a keeper? For sure. Y'all know I love me some good wide leg pants. And why not some pink wide leg pants? They are a little snug here. You know, because, you know, we still unbigging our backs. You know, we are still unbigging our backs. So they're a little snug. But um, I think I'm going to go ahead and keep these. Um, I feel like the more I wear them, the looser they get. So I'm definitely going to keep 10 out of 10. Highly recommend. I don't even need y'all to tell me in the comments. I'm digging these for sure. Alright, baby. This next pair. It's giving luxury. It's giving lux. Now, I did see that they had a blouse to go with this. Like a top to go with this. But I wasn't feeling the blouse, the top, as much as I was feeling the pants. But do y'all see these pants? Do y'all see these pants? It's giving luxury. I got these in a size extra large. These were $15.99. Let's go ahead and try these on. <laughs> yes! Come on, pants! Oh, 10 out of freaking 10. I think these were in the bathing suit cover-up section. But, baby, I'm not wearing this for no cover-up. You, are you kidding me right now? This is a whole freaking vibe. Uh, 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 girl, this is a whole vibe. I'm not wearing this as no cover-up. These people done lost their mind, baby. This ain't what this is. This need a cute little puffer top, little crap top um, situation going on with a pop of lip or pop of color, baby. This is a whole vibe. Do y'all see these pants? And they nice and thick. This material was good. This elastic is very stretchy. I love this. I probably could have went down a size to a large, but I grabbed the extra large because you really never know with me. You know that weight, you know, up and down, baby, up and down. You know what I mean? So, but I love these. If you can grab these and you are filling it as a set, go ahead and grab the set for $16. Yes, ma'am. Okay? Yes, ma'am. It's a whole vibe. It's a vibe. It's a vibe for sure. I love, love how comfortable these pants are. It's for sure a vibe. 
All right, next pair. All right, you guys. So this last portion of the Triumph video is tops and bodysuits and graphic tees. Now, one thing Ross is going to give you is graphic tees. I'm going to be honest and say, Ross may be the GOAT of graphic tees. Because they don't care who they put on a graphic tee, baby. You go from Betty Boop to Bugs Bunny to Selena, Ice Cube, Three Six Mafia, Boys in the Hood, Whitney Houston. You got everybody on a graphic tee. So I'm going to try on these tops and I'm going to show you my graphic tees. And we're going to get into it because it's a vibe. Alright you guys, so here is the first top. It's giving Tropicana. It's giving vacation. It has a little cross um little cross number right there in the back. So let's try this on and see what it's giving. Let's see. I believe I got this in an extra large. If I'm not mistaken. Um mm -hmm. Yep, it don't say. Okay, it don't say. I'm about to lie to y'all. It don't even say what, what, what size it is. But let's go ahead and see what it's giving. Let's go ahead and see what she is giving. Because she's cute and these colors are a vibe. I probably will bring out this royal blue situation going on here. I'm going to go ahead and take off this tank real quick. Okay. Oh, she's cute. Oh, yeah. Hold on, tank top. Get out the way. All right. Oh, come on. You can't say this ain't giving Patty Baby with the sleeves. Uh, uh, oh my God, this is cute. All right, you see the crisscross number in the back? So I guess it's supposed to have your back out in the back. But I have on this tank top just for this video. Shouts, baby. Pull down. Pull down these shouts. All right, this is cute. I can definitely see this with a pair of shorts or a pair of jeans or even a skirt. But it's giving. It's giving. Oh, these sleeves are these sleeves are a moment. Let's just take a moment for the sleeves itself. Between the sleeves and the colors, baby, I am convinced that I need to keep the shirt. Uh I am convinced that I need to keep this baby. What y'all thinking? Okay, what y'all thinking? I like this a lot. Like I said, I would probably play on this royal blue for me. But I just love when I put my hands together. It's giving, pass me the great coupon, peasant. Pass me, pass me the great coupon, baby. It's giving luxury. It's giving somebody's wife. You know what I mean? It's giving. You know what I mean? I like this. I am digging this whole vibe. Like, I just feel like as soon as you put your hands together, it's a moment. It's like, what did you say? Don't talk to me. <laughs> it's giving. I love this. Love, love, love. What y'all think? Keep or return, baby. Uh, I love how you can just pull down the sleeves even more. Come on, Tank Top. You're acting the fool now. All right. It's giving. What y'all think? Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments. I'm about to fly away right now. Just let me know. All right. <laughs> Alright, you guys, I know I look a little crazy right now, but I did pick up two bodysuits. This is one of them. I did keep my shorts on because I didn't want to show y'all my goods here on this channel. And I don't want YouTube to ban me thinking I'm on here trying to be a scripper or nothing like that. You know what I mean? So here is the bodysuit. It was the color, really, for me. It does have a lot of stretch, so I probably could have sized down. This is a extra large, so I probably could have went large if I wanted to be honest. But we love a good bodysuit because they are amazing under your clothes until you got to go to the bathroom. <laughs> until you got to go to the bathroom, baby, it's a problem, okay? You know, I got a little extra. It's my These are my shorts, you guys, so it's all good. But this is how it looks on. This is the first one. Definitely would have to wear a bra with this one. Um... Do I think that this one snatch you like a traditional bodysuit can? No, it's a little bit more giving. But I do believe if I go down a size, it will probably snatch me a little bit more. But this color is amazing. Let me give you a visual. Let me give you a visual. Here's another little color block moment. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Color block moment. This is the color block moment. Can y'all see this together? You can't tell me this isn't a moment, baby. This blue and this green together is every 
single thing and I love it. So, don't ever be afraid to get the light blues. It, it, it goes with a lot. You can pair this even with yellow. It'll be amazing. Okay, so this is the first jumpsuit. Or, I'm sorry, this is the first bodysuit. Let's get into the next one. So, this next bodysuit, I was being a little risque. I ain't gonna lie, but I think I love it. I ain't gonna hold you. Like, you see the front. You know what I mean? It's giving no bra. It's giving you ain't got to wear no bra and I'm snatched. You know what I mean? But let's get into this back. The whole back is out, baby. The whole back is out. It is out, y'all. Can y'all see the back? She out. But you know, and the rose is out. But you know I don't give a shit about none of that. Because who going to check me? Who going to check me about my rose, baby? I ain't even big my back yet for the summer. But this is giving, baby. I feel like this is it. I love this bodysuit. 10 out of 10. I'm not going to even hold you. Because it is super, super sexy. Can you imagine wearing this with like... A super, on a casual day, super, super cute pair of jeans, fitted jeans with some nice pumps or some open toe heels, and just have your whole back out. You and Bay walking down the street and the whole back is out? Oh, man. It's giving, it's giving a vibe. These shorts don't want to let me be great. It's giving a whole vibe. Now, I got a size large. I think I would go ahead and size up because, as you can see, the straps keep coming down and they're not adjustable they don't have a lot of support back there since your entire back is out but definitely a vibe definitely a whole vibe i definitely would size up and i don't gotta wear no bra the girls is out can i run let's see can i oh i can run baby they ain't coming out so definitely would size up in this one um, for me, you know, know your sizes, baby. Know your sizes. I grabbed a large just to see how it was going to do, but I think I'm going to go back and get an extra large. But I'm definitely going to keep this because the girls need a good bodysuit in their wardrobe. For sure. Okay. Last couple items are my graphic tees. And I did grab one swimsuit, you guys. So I'm going to show that um, to you guys next. And we're done with this video. So here are the two graphic tees that I grabbed. First one, Ice Cube. West Side. <laughs> and then I grabbed Bob Marley. Because y'all know Juneteenth is coming. So I had to grab the Bob Marley. The Bob Marley seemed a little small, baby. I don't know what size this is. But it says a large. We're going to try this one on first. But it's given medium. But we're about to see. Alright. Bob Marley first. Yeah, she giving a little, <laughs> she giving a little, I don't know, okay? She giving a little, I'm not sure, okay? Yeah, she's giving a little bit, I'm not sure about this one, okay? This one might be a little tight, but we gonna see. Oh, yeah, yeah, she a little tight. So, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, she cute. And she'll be cute with a pair of, um, definitely a pair of um, slacks. But I like my shirts a little bit. You know, I need a little room, baby. I feel like, I, you know, I'm about to break out of this thing, okay? She a little tight, just a little bit. But um, she cute nonetheless. All right, Bob, we're going to have to go ahead and upside, you know, get a little, get a bigger. We're going to have to uh, upgrade the size on this one because, um, baby, as you can see, I can't even get this mother effer off. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. See? This is why we got to unbig our backs, okay? This is why we got to unbig our backs, because this is crazy, all right? This is crazy. All right, next one. All right, I'm going to go ahead and try this one on. All right, so this is definitely more my speed. I love how this one fits. I love how it comes down. Love. And y'all know... Um, graphic tees are a must in your wardrobe, you guys. This goes with jeans, slacks, um, skirts, everything. A graphic tee and a blazer and a pair of jeans is a staple. You know what I mean? This one, I just love the colors on this one. Of course, I'm going to have to keep this one because I just got makeup all over it, but it's all good. But the colors are giving... And then turn to the back. This is how far it goes down on me, you guys. So this is more of my speed. This is more of my size. And I believe this one is an extra large, if I'm not mistaken. Let me see. Yeah, 
Oh, this one is a large. Oh, but this is a men's. This is a men's large. So, definitely, let me see if I can get this thing on makeup out. Definitely more of my vibe. That Bob Marley one, I felt like I was about to, I felt like, baby, I, listen, I just felt like I was a bodybuilder. Okay, I felt, I felt a little, a little restricted, okay? But this one is more of my vibe. And I love graphic tees, like I said, um, as I mentioned in my ebook. And if you have not got my ebook, I'll drop it in the comments. But I did drop an ebook on outfit formulas. And wearing a graphic tee was one of the outfit formula. Go and grab that. It'll be in the comments and all that good stuff. And it'll explain why a graphic tee is so essential to your wardrobe. All right. So the last and final piece is a bathing suit, you guys. We're going to try that on. And let's get into it and rate it and do all we need to do. All right, you guys, so this is the bathing suit. Um, I'm feeling it. Listen, T don't wear no bathing suit unless it's high-waisted, and this one is super cute. I love the contrast and color. So we got the black and white top and then the all-black bottoms. I did keep my underwear on, you guys, just in case I wanted to take this one back. I didn't want to put my JJ all in something I was going to return. So super 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 cute this is a size extra large love 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 get into it it's super cute super dainty and this um and it's uh very much vacation ready it's a whole vibe and a whole look i am digging this you guys like i said if it ain't high-waisted don't look over here baby i ain't got it on i ain't got one of them stomachs where you can cut and show up no no ma'am I got a mommy stomach, you know what I mean? So we got to cover this up with the high waisted and bring it up. But this is a vibe. Like, I am mad comfortable in this right now. I would wear this out just like this. I probably would throw on a cover up. If I had a cover up right now, I'll show you guys. But I don't have one in here. But if I had a cover up, I probably would just throw my cover up on the bottom and wear the top as like a regular top. Um, she is giving... Um, little i mean i think i'm gonna show a you know you will show a little under boob but i'm okay with that because you're supposed to be sexy at the beach i'm okay with that i am okay with that all right you guys so that is all i got for this haul you guys i hope that something in this video has changed your mind about shopping at ross for me i have been shopping at ross since i was a uh, knee high to a horse my foster mom loved ross so we probably visit every ross in the Bay Area, no lie. Um, so, I tend to go to Ross a lot. Here's what I want y'all to take away from this video. Ross is one of those stores that everybody sleep on. Because, I don't know if it's their aesthetic and how sometimes it can be very unorganized. But, Ross has the potential to be on the same caliber as a TJ Maxx or a Marshalls. No lie. Because, I have gone into a Ross... I have bought Gucci glasses from Ross, authenticated Gucci, Gucci glasses from Ross, uh, Halston from Ross, Movado. I have bought so many items from Ross, just not even the name brands. Stuff like this that's practical, inexpensive, and it's super cute, good, good material, good quality, and it's going to last me for a long time. All my graphic tees that you ever have seen me in have come from Ross. Ross is the GOAT for graphic tees. So... Don't be too hasty about judging Ross because their customers sometimes treat their store like trash and their employees feel like they don't need to clean it up because you can find some hidden gems in Ross. I bought my luggage from Ross. I still have my luggage. It's still in good condition. Again, I have bought so many items from Ross. You see those Aldo bags. This Aldo bag here, right here, has come from Ross. I have so many different items from Ross. So I just want you to take the time and give it a chance. Some Rosses are clean, are cleaner than other Rosses. And some Rosses just give me the blues. Some Rosses I've walked in and it's just shit everywhere. You know what I mean? I can't even lie to you and say that that has not been my experience. But what I will say to you is that once I take the time to actually see what they have to offer... I have come out with some beautiful items that are still in my wardrobe today. So, take the opportunity, give it a chance, and you know, we are balling on a budget, baby. So, Ross is one of those places where you want to get designer on a budget you need to go and look out. Because like I said, I have these Gucci glasses, here, right here, are from Ross. Um, had them authenticating and everything. They are real deal, holy feel. So... 
give Ross a chance, you guys, on your day off, when you're going out and shopping. I would prefer to go on like a weekday when there's not a lot of people in because on a Saturday, um, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, it's always packed. Go on a weekday. Give it a chance to see what you can find. I know every Ross is different, so every Ross won't have all of these items. But I will say, if you go there within the week time, that's why I'm doing this video now, because I bought these within the week time, you should be able to find these um, these items. Um, they have anywhere from Calvin Klein to um, Karl Lagerfeld. It's a vibe in there, you guys. Just give it a chance and give it an opportunity. I hope this video was helpful. I hope that you learned something and you saw something in this video that you need to get up, grab your keys, go ahead and head to your nearest Ross. And I will continue to do these videos because I am a huge advocate for Ross. I think Ross, Ross is a vibe and I think you can get a bang for your buck in there. Um, better than these other fast fashions, but we're not even going to go there. But I will be dropping another video next week, you guys. So until then, see y'all later.